Now to the fiery remarks made by President Biden tonight. He angrily pushed back on a special counsel report that he'd mishandled classified documents and has memory problems. CBS 2's Dick Brennan is here in studio with more. Dick. Christina Maurice, this was a tense press conference. The president getting testy, listening to pointed questions from reporters. And even appearing to misspeak while talking about foreign policy in the Middle East. But he contradicted findings in the documents report and angrily defended any questions about his age and memory. Many American people have been watching and they have expressed concerns about your age. That is they, your judgment. They, that is they your judgment. Public that is not the judgment concerns. of the press. President Biden fuming over questions about his age and his memory. That's that's my memory. memory has gotten worse, Mr. No, President. Look, my memory is not gotten. My memory is fine. My memory, take a look at what I've done since I've become president. In declining to press charges in the documents case against President Biden, special counsel Robert Hur wrote that if he did, the president would likely present himself to the jury as he did during his interview with our office as a sympathetic, well-meaning elderly man with a poor memory. The report also says Mr. Biden did not remember the dates of when he was vice president, and he did not remember even within several years when his son Bo died, an allegation that infuriated Mr. Biden tonight. There's even reference that I don't remember when my son died. How in the hell dare he raise that? Frankly, when I was asked the question, I thought to myself, it wasn't any of their damn business. The report includes photos of records crammed into desk drawers, some in a damaged cardboard box in the garage at his Delaware home, others at a former office in Washington, D.C. The special counsel said Mr. Biden's conduct presented serious risks to national security. But tonight, the president said it was his staff that was moving things in and out of his house. I take responsibility for not having seen exactly what my staff was doing. Her said a case against the president would be hard to prove beyond a reasonable doubt. He said Mr. Biden was cooperative, while former President Trump, who was charged in a separate investigation, allegedly did the opposite. The special counsel acknowledged I cooperated completely. I did not throw up any roadblocks. I sought no delays. Former President Trump released a statement saying the results tonight prove that there is a two-tiered system of justice. And on foreign policy tonight in his press conference talking about the war in the Middle East, President Biden confused the president of Egypt with the president of Mexico. He also sharply criticized Israel's response in Gaza, calling it over the top. Maurice and Christine. All right, Dick, thank you.